All right. Here Get we go. Started. Just uh, having a sip of my Arizona iced green tea with ginseng. I'm just having a die coke. You're doing way better than I am. Imagine. All right. We All are right. seeing small battlefield. I knew it was going to be a smaller stage. And Puck goes in right off the bat, lands some combo starters, and Dami was flying. The one thing I love about Puck as a player is he's one of the most aggressive players. He he plays his game for fun. Ooh, yeah, you can see it in everything he does. He's just going for those big combos, getting that cool movement in. I just love watching him play. Oh yeah, absolutely. Uh, that meme already at 97%, uh, 3% away from the Go Juice. Yeah, sometimes that meme like doesn't hit anyone for the entire stock, and then he gets Go Juice, and they just die. So I don't even know who's won this stock yet. Yeah. Uh, there's a very real chance that Puck will just get blown up by uh, Buster Wolf or by Power Geyser. Uh, and that was the very real chance. Yeah. Um, he did miss the Power Geyser, but it was baiting out the, the oh. jump. Oh! Very up smash. Love to see it. I'm about that life. Puck is an auto-canceler between socks. Gives you a lot of information about him as a person. Yeah. Oh! Oh no! Good night, Danny! That is tragic! Right at the tail. I, I, that wasn't the, uh, the empowered up was it? Because I feel like no, he wouldn't have been able to get hit. I, I think the it's just invincible on the startup. I believe, oh, or even okay. most of it. He'd have to charge down though. Like he got hit pretty far off stage. I don't think he had the frames to charge it and get up in time. He was just kind of screwed, especially with the time it's gonna take to react to something like that. Yeah, uh, Daddy doing a really good job of sort of keeping Puck in disadvantage. But as I say, that Puck gets his first up tilt. Uh, this doesn't convert it into much, but uh, that wall, that wall jump into the side B gets him back on stage. Ooh, down yeah. smash. Ooh. Let's go. Oh, he's just running through everything here. That meme tries to put up a wall, and Puck just walks straight through it. He does not care. Absolutely nothing cared. Uh, he tries to go for that up tilt, but he gets uh, stuffed out by the Terry forward tilt. That meme does a lot of really interesting stuff with crack shoot. Like, uh, last tournament I saw him using the first hit of it a lot and just using it for really weird combo starters. It's really fun to watch. Uh, the one oh. thing I've noticed- Oh. Oh no. That's also tragic. Well, Puck takes game one! So, I think, honestly, but I think that meme was doing a very good job and probably could have won that game if he didn't get, uh, Falco cheesed at- with- off of his rising tackle. <laughs> yeah, but this is also gonna give Puck some momentum. Oh, At yeah. the very least, it might give him a tri -plat game three if that meme wins game two. And when you get Falco on a tri -plat, you are going up. <laughs> that is very true. That is very true. Uh, the other things I was noticing, Puck uh, was doing uh, his up tilt in reverse. So he was trying to get that um, that uh, later hit of up tilt, uh, which I don't think was benefiting him very well uh, in those neutral positions where that meme was just trying to poke him out with uh, some of his normals. Uh, uh, Puck one. Puck one, game one. No flammo. Well, we're going to game two. I'm guessing we're going to go to a flatter stage here. You never want to get Falco platforms, and that meme probably knows that. Yeah. And anywhere that you can sort of restrict Falco's landing options is always better. Go and here, you can do. This is a good neutral stage. Yeah, very good neutral stage. Uh, and I think it does benefit uh, the way that Puck wants to uh, work as opposed to. Sorry, not Puck, uh, that meme. Mm hmm. Puck really wants to get these big combos, so that meme just made himself some space to keep him out. Yep, for sure. Uh, and Jeff, Jeff, already, it's really working for him. Getting a lot of these power dunks, a lot of these really well-spaced moves, so he might be able to get that early advantage. Very true. Uh, oh. Another power dunk, shouldn't take it yet, uh, but the sides of PS2 are deceivingly small. Yeah, I think Puck could be dead here soon. Next time he gets touched by that Terry jab. Ooh, that might be it. There That's it goes. I think Puck is showing a little bit of hesitation. I saw him like read out or call out an air dodge, but uh, just didn't punish on it. Uh, mm -hmm. So let's see how well he does on. Cool, that hesitation Ooh. is gone. He just got a really nice combo, but Dabim has go. We could see some really big damage from here. Yeah, press those four tilts reverses the power dunk there. Uh, up smash will not take it yet. Uh, but just playing around neutral just a little bit. Uh, whiffs a grab, almost gets Buster Wolf for it. Oh, and that's going to be a Buster Wolf. As soon as you see that down tilt, F tilt, you know what's coming. Uh, power Dunk will take that stock. 
So now, Terry with Go Juice. Uh, yup, and here comes another power oh, no. 48% of the bat! 72 and almost a kill! Dude. As I was saying, this is what Buster Tatmeme Wolf does when you guys get Go Juice! Plus, Wolf Power Guys are my favorite combo. <laughs> okay. Uh, Thor 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 should take that stock. So no longer has his juice. No longer has his juice. Uh, bus, uh, power Dunk uh, will put him up to 90, though. This is a very rough situation for Puck. He has to play, I think, relatively safe. That is not how you play safe, though. Oh, boy. Yeah, I don't know what's really going to happen for Puck this next game. He's going to have to adjust. He's going to have to find a way in a lot more without getting hit by those jabs. Then again, he'll probably get a much better stage for that. I think the biggest thing with Puck is I don't know, like, what his confidence is at this moment. Uh... I, I think he needs to be, like, more aggressive in the face of Terry. Mm, I think he just needs to play around where those jabs and down tilts are going to be. He has to stay up, use his lasers a little, possibly, and just in general get around Terry to the point where he's not getting down tilted off every approach. Yeah, that's a fair point. Um, Stage-wise, you mentioned already that he probably wants to go to Triplats, which, if I am that meme, I'm probably banning Triplats. Yeah, I'm banning Story and Battlefield. Those are absolutely gone. So, as Puck, I might just want to run it back to uh, Small Battlefield. Yeah. That seems worked out well for him, all things considered. Yeah. 100%. Yeah. Or even just, like, any small stage I could see being beneficial for Puck. All right. Getting back into it. I don't think Puck's going to do a character switch. I don't think either of these players uh, think that this is unwinnable. Yeah, I think Puck might be able to bring this back if he plays well, though. Let's see what's up with the sure. chat. All right, we're going to Smashville. This is also a really good choice for Falco. Especially since he needs to kill that meme early and just get rid of that go juice. That was his downfall last game. As much as I agree, the thing that concerns me is Smashville is a very small stage, which means that if you get that meme into Go Sauce area, he will just destroy you. Yeah. Match, these power dunks, uh, <laughs> I don't, I don't think Puck knows how to get around those power dunks. Not too well. I mean, this is high risk, high reward in the stage pick, and that's how Puck likes to play. That is very true. Uh, the other thing I'm noticing, I don't think Puck entirely knows how he wants to approach that meme. He's, he's yeah. pulling the Smash 4 where he's running up and shielding a lot, which understandable given the circumstances, but uh, he's playing a lot more passive than I'm used to seeing him play. Yeah, I think he's just waiting. And then Puck approaches and Damien throws out an anti-air. Gets hit. It's just repeating itself a lot with power dunk and sometimes Ooh. up tilt. Ooh. Got those loops going. Who you want to damage. see it? I mean, he got the damage he needed. Yeah, this is... This is salvageable. Yeah, 100%. It's gonna be hard to salvage though. He just has to stop getting pressured at ledge like this. Stop getting hit by these big power dunks. So that situation there uh, where he shielded the power dunk and uh, got jabbed immediately, I think he didn't know how safe that move was. Oh, that's a really nice conversion. The knowledge that that meme is showing that <laughs> once he hit that power wave, he could go immediately into burning knuckle. That was crazy. That yeah, was really nice to see. And Gojuice is out, 3-1. to one. This is where Damien excels. He's doing so well without it. Power oh guys my lord. are killing. Damn. Oh, and that's it. That, that should definitely be it. As Buster soon as Wolf. I saw that down tilt, I knew it was game. The Buster Wolf. It's an interesting set. Wait. No, very, very explosive set. 